Not long ago, Corey had no effing idea they made fries at Pizza Hut. Not that long at all. Well, they do have fries. They have fries? We learned that at the, uh, the hut box. You can get fries instead of, um... What? Yeah, they got fries. We should have gotten that. Today, we have two donors, two people who are making this video possible. As you saw from the thumbnail and the title, this is a versus. McDonald's iconic Golden Arch fries versus the Pizza Hut fries that we just found out exist. This made possible here today. $42 donation from Kelsey Kujno. My cousin. And a $25 donation from Larry Gonzalez. It might have been 20 bucks. Legend. 20, 25. 25. 25. Yeah. I was right the first time. Trust your gut. Never, never doubt yourself, Sean. Never doubt yourself. So today we're gonna put them against each other, go over price, flavor, the whole thing. And probably turn a lot of people on, I mean, because we're sexy, and to the fact that Pizza Hut has fries. You are ugly. A sixer shout out to Eric Paller, who donated his money. He paid for a hamburger logo t-shirt and a two pack of sixer sauce. Eric, thank you so much for doing that. Number six with cheese.com. Get yourself some of our tasty nectar and you'll get a shout out. Okay, here we go. Whoa. Sh can I, can I just snag two medium fries? Two medium fries? Anything else? Nope, that'll be it. Perfect, you can pull up next window. Thank you. Yep, thank you. 6.38. Not cheap. 6.38. Three night. It's like kind of a crazy place. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, you too. I'll be honest, this is not a video I thought we'd ever do. Pizza Hut French fries versus McDonald's fries. Acquired jump cut. There you go. These are yours. Already taking a point off. Why's that? Well, how am I gonna get any of one of the most glorious things in America? Bag fries. Oh yeah, you get no spillage. I want the spillage. It's a cool container and it's piping hot, but wow. you're right. Maybe that's the trade-off. That is a cool container. Before we get started, McDonald's medium, 319. Pizza Hut's only size, 475. Whoa, I haven't looked to see how many there are, so it might be okay. Right, we gotta look at portions, but before you know, now you know. Corey Wagner, second angle. Okay, McDonald's, classic. You guys know it. Uh, you guys understand that's what a medium looks like. And then here's this cool little bowl box thing. Wow, four bucks for that little amount? That doesn't Almost seem like Almost five much. bucks. After tax, more than five dollars. Wow. I mean, do look Cajun, do look delicious. They do, um, they look like bar fries, like a really good bar fry. Yeah, interesting. And also closer to like a Checkers and Rallies look. Like these look entirely different. Yeah, they do. But you gotta verse it against like the, the fry that I think most people, if you had to pull everyone in America, I think McDonald's would be in first. Fry God? That's just what, I'd say I think the Fry God is McDonald's. Yeah, they're wrong, it's obviously right. like it's, it's Rallies. Yeah, checkers. Arby's is up there. Yeah, yep. But you know, Popeye's slept on. Yep, yep. Our third fave. All right, for science. Yeah. And we might need a sec second angle for this. Tell me what you think. I don't know what the, these look like. There's less, right, in the KFC. I know exactly what you're gonna or say. Not the KFC, the I want a second. I know what you're doing. I want a second. Corey Wagner, second angle. Uh, see, compared to the same, definitely more. Yeah, more and fries than the medium. Can, now you can kind of tell. You do mine too, just in case. Yep. Ah, yours is about even. That's what the f McDonald's is taking up. It's a lot closer, I'd say. We had a very similar experience when we did that in the shower together. Remember, we both had... <laughs> yeah, I do remember that. I'll never forget. What? One interesting thing about both of these, McDonald's fries do not come with a dipping sauce. Pizza Hut's fries do not come with a dipping sauce. Raw dogging. They both can come with ketchup. Can. Does it come in the bag? Pizza Hut did. Oh, okay. McDonald's... And McDonald's... You have to ask. You have to I, like to, I like to talk about these things. Yeah, no, that's a good point. Even if you're not a ketchup guy or, or gal, like, it's nice to have the option. Yeah. Okay, anyways, this is a genius move by Corey. I'm so glad he thought of that. I think we gotta start with what we don't know yeah, first. Guys, I don't sorry, want guys. McDonald's to, like, coat my mouth. Ooh, they're piping hot, dude. Yeah, they've done well. All right, Pizza Hut Cajun fries. Cheers. Guys. That's a good french fry. Where have we been? Mmm. Right out of the fryer. Mm-hmm. That's a good french fry. <laughs> That's a really good french fry. Alright, I mean I've had McDonald's. That's a great french fry chill. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Wow, okay. These fries from Pizza Hut 
are more of an event. If I'm yeah. ordering a bunch of little things at Pizza Hut, bread, wings, pizza, like a bunch of stuff, this is more of the fries I want with that order. Yep. The McDonald's fries are kind of the workhorse of it goes with everything on the menu. Different reasons. Yeah. Uh, what's the price here again? Four seventy-five before tax. Wow. I mean, the three nineteen is not great, but no. four seventy-five is crazy to me. It's a big price. You're just one one hand down the uh, couch cushion before you can get a little Caesar's hot, hot ready. A lot of people have told us you can't get those anymore. Oh, is that right? People keep claiming that, um, I really do think the prices at Little Caesars vary so much by region. Mm. There is a pizza, there's a Little Caesars in Chicago on the Northwest side, like one we've been to, where it's six bucks. Mm. And that is the cheapest I've found it on the apps. I believe it. But I get exactly what you're saying. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I really like this. And I really like that. It's a great french fry. It's a really good french fry. This is classic. Yeah. This is great. We're not asking it to go away. No. But I kind of like, kind of like the, there's some other people coming into town. I really do. These are made, they're fresh. So I don't know if you're getting delivery, you might lose some of this, but crispy outside, super fluffy golden inside, and a lot of seasoning. Look at this one. Yeah, they really season this it This thing up. is absolutely covered. That's good. Cut this if you need to. Mm -hmm. Now, I know we don't like to talk about politics here, but I I'm sorry. This, I think, is what politicians want America to look like. This is how I want... Actually, no, because we need to be more mixed up. Yeah, there's too many whites on top there. <laughs> this is what I want America to... This is what, this is what the really, people want. That was really nice, Corey. With a lot more mating and interbreeding, we'll be, we'll yeah, be there. Yeah, well, yeah, that's right. I think I will leave that in. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess it's official. Mm. Honestly, kind of more fun having like, you can kind of get two of them. Oh, two at once, huh? Two at once, or just even like having a couple of the Pizza Huts and getting yourself a McDonald's one, kind of like finding the onion ring in there at BK. It's nice having the back and forth. Mm. I'm gonna be honest with you. This is elite. I think Pizza Hut's fry, I think this is like a better French fry in the sense that like, there's more flavor, they're thicker. Yeah, there's more mass. There's just more to it. Yep. But nothing can really take down a McDonald's fry. No. Like no matter what comes out in the world, fast food wise, McDonald's fries will will stand. Well, they'll outlive all of us. Yep. It'll withstand the test of time. Like if we get hit by an asteroid, these McDonald's fries will be in the in the soil for yeah, thousands of it's years. Them and cockroaches. Yeah. Bro, what are you talking about, man? I'm gonna be honest with you though. These Pizza Hut fries are way better than I thought they were gonna be. Way better. I was thinking like, at best, they were gonna be like a fairly below, like a little below average. Right. These are phenomenal. They're very good. If you don't like Cajun seasoning, they got them just straight up, straight cut, or you can do lemon pepper. And it barely adds any calories. Wow. Also, once again, shout out Kelsey, shout out Larry. We just, anything we say in these videos, we're like, oh, that'd be fun. People always got our backs. Yep. Like, that's so rare in this life. It is. I got to hang out with Kelsey not too long ago for our cousin's wedding. It was fun. I'd like to meet her. Yeah, she's cool. I mm. keep going to the Cajun ones. Like, without thinking, I'm like, you know, your mind just kind of yep. picks what it wants and keeps going left. What's your Mount Rushmore of fast food fries? As of today, I know it changes. Yeah, yeah. What is it today? Right now, this minute, Arby's. Yeah. Actually, is number one right now. Okay. Then, actually, ooh. Not going rallies. Uh, I think you say Wendy's. And then pep and then uh, Popeyes. And Popeyes. What's the fourth? Four four faces. Mm. I'm gonna say if I have to pick one for the fourth, I'm gonna say Wendy's, which is mind blowing. It is. How much hate? It I've took been. a while. Yeah. My Mount Rushmore is rallies, Arby's, Popeyes. Man, the fourth slot is tough. Those three are so far ahead of everybody yeah, else to yep. me. I feel like I'm gonna put McDonald's on there. They're just so, they're so freaking good. I like will crave them. There's only so many fast mm -hmm. food fries I crave when yep. I'm just like sitting around. I can like, when I'm hungover, I can go for some McDonald's fries. Oh God, yes. I'm just gonna do it. Super thanks shout out. When you click the thanks button on the show, you get a shout out. $2, Paul Havelka. $25, Larry Gonzalez, which is from this video, and $5, Derek Boudreaux. Thank you guys so much. Comment, click, we'll give you a shout out. Super thanks to the show, we love you for it. Don't forget to like, subscribe to Number Six with Cheese, and before we rate this here today, what is your Mount Rushmore? Four presidents, four fries, of french fries in the fast food game? Comment below. Excellent question. Are you gonna pick which one you liked better today? <sighs> Incorporate the price, incorporate it all. Okay. The experience today, you know? Did you start any music? Alex Trebek. Oh, thank you. Yeah, he heard you. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a tough one. They both have their... 
pros. And I really don't think that they're gonna be that good every time you order them. I think I've gotten real good at timing it on the orders on this show. All right, cut it off, cut it off. Mine's, mine's like heavily based on price. Yeah, I get that. Okay. Uh, on the count of three, are you ready? Yep. One, two, three. Boom. Bam. I kind of thought that's what it was going to be. The hut today, I was just blown away by the pipe and hotness, the seasoning. It was really good. I I honestly don't know how many times in the future I'll get them, well, but today, every dog has his day, dude. Yeah, every dog has his day. What is that one thing every broken clock is right twice a day? Yep. I don't know if that applies to this situation, but it sounded like it might. <laughs> All right. We're done. We're off work. It's time to go have a cold one. We're going to see you guys very soon. Thank you for being here and supporting this silly little show. Just love them so much. Oh, I thought you were having a heart attack. I'll <laughs> see you guys soon.